We just got to the Viagen farm. There are a lot of surrogate mares here, which are beautiful. This facility is unbelievable. This place is gorgeous and it's located in Texas. So if you see us sweating today, it's because we're gonna be out here in the hot sun. I'm Dr. Lindsay Butzer, a small animal veterinarian from Clintmore Animal Hospital in Boca Raton, Florida. And today I'm here in Pleasanton, Texas with Viagen Pets and Equine Company to introduce you guys to our new baby pony named Rico Suave. So if you guys remember that video that I made in April 2019, which was about a year and nine months ago, where we took samples of Rico Suave, the adult pony, that we now made a little clone of today. So we're gonna show you some super cute video of that. And then we're gonna also meet the veterinarian who helps make these ponies out on this farm. So let me introduce you to Lauren. So this is Lauren. Hi, thank you for having me, Lindsay. So we are here at Zerlotti Genetics in Pleasanton, Texas. Um, and I'm Lauren Aston from Viagen Pets and Equine. So today we're here seeing the little baby Rico. He's so cute. I know, he's adorable. <laughs> Um, so basically to get to this point where you're gonna get a clone, all we need is a small skin biopsy sample that your veterinarian would take. It's very, very similar to if you've ever had a mole removed on your own body, Lindsay. Okay. So that's all we need. And your veterinarian will take two to four samples and it's $1,600 to be able to store the DNA forever. And that just gives you a peace of mind and almost a little insurance policy that your dog, cat, or horse is still alive in some form or fashion. So Lauren has a really cool example of one of their clones that they've made. So she's gonna tell you about that. Absolutely, so we are so excited at the beginning of August of this year, 2020, we had a foal named Kurt born, who is a Chevalsky horse. Wow. And we were able to partner with the amazing San Diego Zoo and revive and restore to bring back some of the original genetics of the Chevalsky horse. So it's a really cool story. Um, but here on this ranch at Zerlotti Genetics, there are over a hundred mares holding cloned ponies. Wow, that is amazing. Over a hundred right now that they have in process on this farm. That Absolutely. Is so cool. It's wonderful. And you know, we clone dogs, cats, and horses. Um, so again, for all, all species, whether it's dog, cat, or horse, all we need is that small skin sample via our process called genetic preservation that's $1,600. Now I'm here with Dr. Mario Zerlotti and we're in the equine reproductive lab. So you can see we have some cool microscopes here with us and Dr. Mario Zerlotti is gonna tell us about how you take this embryo and prepare it to be ready to be put into the surrogate. Yes, uh, let me go back a little bit about the Viagen part and Dr. Sean Walker who does the cloning. He used a microscope like this one to introduce the DNA inside the, the oocyte, inside the egg and then after he have all the embryos ready. It frees the embryos, mm -hmm. shipped to us here to South Texas, to Pleasanton. And this container, we take it out of the container. This is where he ships the embryos in. Right. And then we thaw in the special media, the same media that Sean prepared to. Okay. And it's shipped to us. We thaw in five, 10 minutes, be ready to transfer the recipient mare and a surrogate mother. That's so fast, in yeah, five it's minutes. Crazy. The protocol they, they develop to freeze the embryo is very special, it's very unique, very important because you have high pregnancy rates and you have a high birth rates too. Mm -hmm. I mean, they, they are the best in, in that part. In cloning. In the world. In the They're world. the best in the yes, world at doing this. The best in the world in doing this. That's amazing. So how did you choose the mare that we're gonna see out with little Rico today? Well, to choose the mare, we pretty much go by the size. You know, we, we do transfer for warm bloods, jumping horse, polo horses. And one we notice is a, it's a jumping pony. The mare had, have to be a medium mare, no very big mare. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is how we choose the mare, by the size it comp and attitude and mm -hmm. good mamas. All right, that's awesome. Thank you so much, Mario, for having us at your farm in Pleasanton, Texas, being able to see um, baby Rico and where he was born. Uh, I heard that he was a very special baby to you guys, and if you can explain um, the reasons why he was so special when he was born. 
Oh, welcome. It's a, it's an honor to have a take care of the baby Rico here. It's it's funny because he was very smart since he was born. You know, he stand up in kind of 15 minutes, start nursing 20, 25 minutes, start nursing a mare, and acting like have a little attitude already. And you know, he's a he's a very fun baby to be around. And you can see he's, he's running in the pasture and change leads and look around and the tail up. It's it's really cool. And it's really fun to He seems very athletic and um, very much like his clone who definitely knows he's a beautiful, well-liked pony. I'd like to thank Lauren and Blake Russell for this amazing experience with Viagen, cloning Rico, my famous pony, Rico Suave. It's been a dream come true, and um, it's so exciting being here in Pleasanton and seeing him, and he is amazing. I mean, I couldn't have asked for anything better, and my experience with you guys all along the way being positive, and it's just beyond words. I'm super excited for this pony to grow up. My, my dream is to improve the, the hunter breed and Rico, baby Rico will stand as a stallion one day when he's a little older. The studies have shown that they're really successful still as stallions and we're excited to see him mature to carry on his genetics in future ponies in the show ring and be as successful as his clone, Rico Suave. Thank you guys for watching this video. We've really enjoyed our time here at the Zerlotti Genetics Farm. It has been so awesome getting to meet baby Rico and touring their farm here and seeing the lab where they get the embryos and implant them into the surrogate mares. It's just all so incredible, the work that they do here. So I've had a blast. I hope you guys have had a great time and I hope you guys learned something about cloning in this video that might inspire you guys to share this video or get into genetics yourself in, in your careers and your lives. So it was really nice being here with Lauren, um, Dr. Zerlotti, and my mom, of course, getting to see her clone pony today.